Good People is the play we're talking about today. Is anybody familiar with it at all? That's why we're at a very special place in our season. Yeah, it takes turns. It's not just a feel-good story about a down-and-out woman who really has mystery. It's a very interesting answer as far as who is a good person and who are good people. I knew with good people that this was a play I wanted to do. Why? Because the story is so beautiful. Um, it's also a bit of a thriller. In an odd way, there's a mystery in the story. The story of Margaret Walsh, who is a woman that grew up in South Boston and in a lower economic strata. She's very working class, very blue collar woman. And very early on in the play, she loses her job at a dollar store. It's one of the most produced plays in the United States this season um, because he got to the heart of a very big issue, which is the American dream, or nowadays maybe the lack thereof. Um, the people in this particular play are very, very human, very funny, and the challenges that they deal with are very real, not unlike anyone who's in the Upper Valley or somebody who's in the Midwest or somebody who's on the West Coast. It occurred to me when she goes through the list and it's not Joyce's medication and this, she doesn't have health insurance, so this is like five hundred thousand dollars right. right. Thank you. It's in the research about South Boston is it's, it's the classic American melting pot that they, nobody wanted to melt. So you've got the black neighborhood, and then you've got the Italian neighborhood, you've got the Chinese neighborhood, you've got... A friend of hers, her best friend Jean, suggests that an old boyfriend of Margie's is back in Boston, and he's a doctor now, and suggests that maybe she goes and talks to him about possibly finding some work. She's too old, she won't get a job, and the play takes place post-2008. It's now. So her employment opportunities are nil. He, he's probably, he, he is the uh, antagonist in, in one sense of the word and uh, is forced to deal with a part of his life that he had put behind him. So there's choice involved and there's luck and there's circumstances and I think this play beautifully evokes that. So that's Good. It's like, it's like, where are you going? Yeah. I was, we're playing a little game here. I, you know, I, it's almost like.